Hey everybody, Brett here, and it's day 206 of my carnivore diet journey. And uh, got to figure out, is stress the cause or an excuse for when you don't follow your plan? Um, stress and pain, actually, today. Um, so... Just, just been a rough couple of weeks at work. Um, not that I have a bad job or a terrible job or anything like that. It's just very uh, complicated in trying to effectively do what I need to do and, and uh, keep uh, coworkers, clients, superiors, everybody happy and moving and everything else. So it's just been rough. And then today to kind of put icing on the cake, I had a lot of pain um, associated with my current medical condition that I'm having surgery for in a couple of weeks and uh, actually ended up having to leave work for the day. Um, came home and, and worked from home. I just, I could not, it was visible that something was wrong. Um, so I had, I had a few people ask me if I was okay. And my answer was, as it always is, yeah, I'm fine. I'm good. And somebody called me on my BS and said, you're not good. You don't look good. Do you need to leave? <laughs> and uh, I said, yeah, maybe if, if it's that visible, maybe I do. So came home and worked from home and, you know, finished out my day. Went up and, uh, and got some more, a little more color added into my arm. So, uh, um, yeah, so... Weight this morning, uh, 234.3. So it's up a little bit more. Um, and then today I had intentions of fasting, um, did not fast. So, um, and then when I didn't fast and I ate something, I was like, screw it, I can just eat. So I ate a lot more than I should have today. And it wasn't all good stuff. So... It's, it's frustrating and I might seem depressed or upset or anxious or whatever. Uh, and I am a little bit, right? Because one of the most difficult things that I've ever done is losing over 100 pounds. And right now I'm back under 100 pounds lost. So I need to get my stuff together and I need to figure out how to get back on track. Um, Part, part of the issue is, and I had mentioned this yesterday's video, that I, I stress eat. I emotionally eat. Um, happy, sad, mad, glad, doesn't matter. Um, any emotion for me connects to food and I eat. I've been in a really good even keel the last seven months, eight months. And now that's all kind of shifting. So what is it? Today's the fourth. So it's been almost eight months. So I need to figure out what that key is um, to me getting back to managing my stress and workload and everything else in a better way so that my mind can be clear and I can focus on things that are really important, which is my health, my weight loss, my life. So, um, just, just a little bit of a depressing day when I really look back on it. So, um, goal will be to, um, not fast tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. I'm going to eat clean all day. I'm going to, um, get up in the morning and I'm going to make bacon and I am going to eat my bacon for lunch in the car while I drive to an appointment. I have it lunch tomorrow. Um, then I'll drive back home or back to work, come to my men's group tomorrow night. Um, I'm going to eat food tomorrow night. Uh, don't know what it is right now, but I'm going to eat something for dinner and just try and reset. Right. Um, having an off day Monday and then trying to fast on Tuesday didn't work. 
Stressful day on Tuesday. Stressful day on Wednesday. Didn't work. So I'm going to give myself an easier path tomorrow, a more achievable path, and focus on bacon for lunch, maybe steak for dinner. Um, something that I know I enjoy, I can look forward to, and ideally, I can follow the plan. So that is the plan for tomorrow. And I've said it before, I'll say it again. You got to create a plan, you got to follow the plan. Um, all comes from my diving. Make your plan, dive your plan. So that's how you come back alive in diving. And that's how I'm going to come back on track with my dieting. So that's all I got for today. I didn't take any sugar numbers today. I didn't take any ketone numbers today. My weight was the only thing I took. And um, obviously not happy with it. I assume tomorrow is going to be another gain right now. That's my that's my expectation. I can't get disappointed by that. Um, but I need to get back on track. Bacon, steak, that's how I'm going to do it. So... That's what I got for you today. I will talk to you tomorrow.